Hi everyone, welcome back. Today we're going to learn about how to export your animation to a movie file or alternatively to an image sequence. We're also going to learn a little bit about animating camera movements. Okay, so after you've finished animating or alternatively before you start animating, click on the render tab and then click on output settings. Here we can change the resolution of the camera. Let's set our width to 1920. After you set the width, lock the parameter with this lock button. Then go and set the height. Let's use 1080. If you wish, you can set the start frame and end frame. The save directory is set here. The default is C, open tunes, version number, stuff, sandbox, outputs. Here you can set the file name. The file format can be set here. You can choose from video formats such as AVI or MOV, but you'll need QuickTime in order to use the MOV format. You can also save image files such as BMP, JPG or PNG. Let's use AVI today. One thing to be aware of however is that after you've changed the camera resolution you may have to recompose the scene. To do this use the edit tool. Then click on camera. Now use the scale tool to adjust the scene composition. You can also animate the camera scale or position over time by clicking on the frame and then adjusting the scale or position. OpenTunes will create a keyframe and create the in-between frames. After you've completed composing your scene and animating camera movements, Click on Render, and then Render again. You'll be able to preview the file in the Viewer panel. You may have to right-click and click Fit to Window to see the entire image. Then click Play to preview the file. The file has been saved to the directory that we set earlier. I hope you found this tutorial useful. If you have any suggestions for future tutorials, or if you have any questions, please feel free to leave a comment below. For more tutorials, visit my channel, subscribe, or visit www.computerart.club. See you next time!